Hello, Crossroads Christian School families. So nice to be with you. My name is Tracy Scarce. My husband, Russ Scarce, and I have had three kiddos uh, go through the academic program at Crossroads Christian School through the years. Two of my kids have been there since preschool. Praise the Lord. Um, wow, are we in uncertain times. Uh, I wanted to come to you tonight with a heartfelt message. <laughs> Before I even knew that I was going to be filming this video tonight, I actually had on, we're getting ready to go to dinner. Uh, we're actually in Cabo San Lucas, <laughs> uh, getting ready to go to dinner, and I had put on this shirt, Raising Tomorrow. Uh, I wanted to point the shirt out because I think it's an important message. Um, we found ourselves in uncertain times. Our kids have found themselves in uncertain times. Um, I came here tonight to urge you to continue to keep your kids in Crossroads Christian School. Our kids do not need any more change. Our kids, just because they're going virtual, it does not mean that the experience is going to be less than. And what I want to really help you understand tonight is that the biblical principles of God first school can still happen whether it's in person or online. It is incredibly important that we focus on raising tomorrow. Uh, in fact, there's nothing more important. Let me tell you a short story about our family. Several years ago when we came on uh, upon uncertain times, uh, we almost had to pull our kids out of the school. I prayed and I prayed and I prayed and God made a way but it was a non-negotiable for us to keep our kids in private Christian education. And what I want to challenge you is, have you told yourself at one point in time, my, my kids, our future will be in Christian education? Now it's time to say, will they remain in Christian education? Do we want to see the Christian school education system go away? To me, the answer is no. So I wanted to urge you to really, really challenge yourself to understand that this Crossroads Christian School experience in the coming months, which really, truly, I, I, I don't think it's going to last more than a couple months. Of course, I can't predict the future. That's up to him, right? But I want you to understand the... Education will not be any different than it is if it's in person. Yes, your kids will not have the same social aspect of sitting in a classroom at a desk with their friends. The teaching, the education, the standard of excellence will still be the same. So I really just wanted to come to you and urge you, have you said for your family, that it is above all most important to have your kids in Christian education. And let me ask you, what has changed now? For us, it's nothing. We are ready to continue our kids in Christian, Christian education because God doesn't, doesn't change whether we're virtual or in, um, in a classroom setting. And I really wanna hone that in. Uh, I know you probably don't know me, but our family has a heart to serve. Our family has a heart for Crossroads. We've been here for a long time and we have never, ever, ever been upset about our intentions of keeping our kids within Crossroads Christian School. So in these uncertain times, just know that you are at a God first school that's praying for you, that's valuing your child and putting your child first. Smaller classroom sizes are still an important part of what Crossroads is doing, whether virtual or far apart. I really ask you to be in prayer. Do our kids need more change? They sure don't. Now is the time more than ever to be on guard. God says you can do all things through him who gives me strength. I feel that all things are continuing to keep our kids in the midst. I hope this makes sense to you. I hope that my message um, really speaks to your heart. Um, 
I am a fan and I feel like Crossroads Christian School is part of our family and I don't want that to change. God bless.